A fiduciary is someone who has to act in the best interest of their clients, be truthful and honest in their relationship. Trustpoint, for example, is a fiduciary. They're required to act according to the duty of prudence. That means acting with skill, care, and diligence, and knowing the facts. At Trustpoint, we're certain to do that with all of our clients so that we can get them the best outcomes. Since we are a fiduciary, it's really important for us to avoid conflicts of interest for all of our clients. Simply put, we don't engage in them. We don't have them. We don't work in a way that gives rise to conflicts of interest. Not every financial advisor is held to a fiduciary duty standard. Essentially, there are two standards. First is a suitability standard. That's where you'd pick something that works for the client but isn't necessarily the best one. Suitability doesn't mean that the advisor puts their client's interests first. It only means, is this investment suitable, which is a very gray and imprecise standard. As a fiduciary, we hold ourselves at trust point to a much higher standard. The fiduciary standard is where you are legally required to pick the best option for clients. TrustPoint, just like many fiduciaries, is compensated on an assets under management fee schedule, so we don't have any commissions or kickbacks. It's very transparent and disclosed to all of our clients. At TrustPoint, we always fully disclose our fees, and they're entirely transparent. Generally speaking, they're on one piece of paper, and you can see everything right in front of you. It's easy and easy to calculate, and that's how it should be. I would recommend someone understand how their advisor is compensated to make sure that fits with their overall goal for the portfolio, and then also understand what investments are placed within portfolios. When you meet with a prospective financial advisor or financial planner, simply ask, what are your fees? How am I paying you? And if the answer is complicated or you can't understand it, that's a real red flag. At TrustPoint, we act in our client's best interest. We're legally bound to do that, but it's also part of our philosophy and our culture. The bottom line is, when our clients do well, we do well.